Hello everyone, this is One Super Gamer, and welcome to Riddle School 3. Once again, looks much better. Let's quit, do. No, you're a bear! I love that it does something now. Anyway. Fun fact. Time to make way too long. Alright. Alright, start game. Once again, animation is much better. Starting for the test on Saturday, who can tell me what's wrong with that sentence? A lot. Smiling globe things on the wall is not enough to make me happy. The moo is the best thing about this classroom, besides the door to leave. The world map says you are here, not there. I don't even know how to comment on that. That's Zach. I don't know why, but he's always cool. He ran into the cafeteria while I was burning a few days ago, and all the flames were frozen solid. From little would I pay attention to my science class, that shouldn't be possible. That's Fred. He lent me his whistle to escape a school a while back. Too bad he lost his whistle recently, or I'd be out of here in a matter of seconds. That's Smiley. For some dumb, insane, unfathomable reason, she enjoys her classes. I also noticed that she doesn't sleep. She doesn't. If you were abandoned that air vent, I would get it, but my fingers didn't reach. Aha! Now, what's new about this game is you can combine stuff. There you go. I'm blind, I can't see. That was a very sharp idea, actually. It was kind of blurry. Yes, John Bro made a third real school. I thought he'd never finish. I'm sure to play it as soon as I'm out of this place. No, you're a moose. How are you, Mr. Reed? I'm feeling kind of depressed. I'm a librarian and I can't even read. Well, I can read, but only big print books. You see, my eyesight's like a stuffed monkey doll. It's fuzzy. Hang on, guys. Sorry about that, someone called me. Anyway, what was I doing? I was investigating. LOL. Poem book by Pinky. Penny poem. Five, find five pennies. Find them all. Every penny's in the hall. Real school three secret. Don't beat the game two times straight or else you'll meet a certain fate. Key. Deep in the jungle you'll find a key guarded by creatures that watch from trees. Alright. Face on. Apply directly to the toenail. This message was paid for by Karsh. Zonic. Zonic is awesome, Zonic is awesome, Zonic is awesome, nope. How to read. Read this. This, this Bach was wrote by George, age five. Sweet. Here's a free bookmark. Ah, Penny, Penny in the hall. Come on, there we go. Okay. Girls' bathroom? Nope.
That's what you are not much to say there. Alright. I can see myself in the mirror. Isn't that exciting? Toilet! That's a toilet. Uh, supply closet? closet? Ah, there's a dime up there. Dime's about a foot and a half out of my ring. Aha! Oh, come on. You're so specific. There we go. I have 11 cents. I don't know for sure, but I bet half of these calculators are broken. These are labeled scissors, rulers, pencils, pens, and markers. Definitely saying besides error because nothing they. Okay. What kind of supply closet is this? There isn't anything in the trash can. Paper would be nice if there was a single pencil in this entire building. Tissues are a way to go if you want to sneeze all your snot into something. I really doubt I'll be stapling anything before I escape school. Aqua Cola has only one ingredient. Ah, there's a second floor. The locker's covered with new grounds and you fake scissors. I wish I could say that it was my locker, but sadly it isn't. My locker is a clean yellow locker that's upstairs. There's a new grounds poster on the wall. I'm pretty much the best poster I've ever seen in the school ever. Exit, noun, a door, passage, or another way of leaving a room or building. Example, I'm going to escape the school through the exit. Pigs will probably be flying before I get out of here. There won't be s this that won't stop me from trying though. I just need the counselor's keys and I'll be free. The doors are locked and the lights are out. This count must be someplace else. The, the message on the marquee is very is quite appetizing. That's Greg, he's been sleeping for eight years. His old, my old middle school teacher, Mrs. Sleep, has been asleep for a few years as well. They must be relatives. Maybe. Macaroni, 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 macaroni. Put the cheese in the noodles and what do you get? Macaroni and cheese. An egg on the wall, I'm supposing the school ran out of decorations. What, what can I get for you? Hello, Mrs. Munch, hello. What can I get for you? Are you Chubb's mom? Yes, why? You're fatter than the sun. I can live with that. What can I get for you? Are you Chubb's mom? Yes, why? No reason. What can I get for you? I like chocolate pudding. Sorry, pudding costs a dollar. You don't have enough. All right, so our goal is to get one dollar. Oh, need check for pennies. There's one. Pudding. I need pudding. Which one doesn't belong? The choices are three orange faces and one blue face. Just a hunch, but I think the answer they want is the blue face. Sweet Diz. I think Mr. Reed made that poster. He's a librarian. The school is very strict about nobody escaping through that window, obviously. Of course, I wouldn't be crazy enough to jump out of the window even if I could. Somebody get me out of this locker. Tongs. Ha <laughs> blockhead. Michael Swain is a genius. This is Richie. Help me out. What's the combination? I can never remember. I have her written down. It's in Mrs. Oddford's room. Tell her I need to get out of here. What do you want? Bathroom sink is stuck. No, nope, not possible. Of all the people I would know if a sink was overflowing. I can hear a plumbing problem from a mile away. The hallway's a mess. Yeah, well, I gave up trying to clean the hallways. How could you get the hallways clean? The germ-covered students crowd them multiple times a day. If I actually tried cleaning all the halls, I'd never get done, so I never plan to. Breadcrumbs and beaver spit. 
Sorry, but I don't have bread cubs and beaver stick fit with me. I think I'll leave now. Nickel. Why does the only clock in the whole school have to be on the poster? B. Carrots are people too. They live, they die, they look orange. Or something like that. The doors are locked and the lights are out. Mrs. Offer must be someplace else. Oh yes! Where'd you come from? The hallway. Shoo! <laughs> Where'd you come from? I fell asleep in class. So? I woke up. Shoo! <laughs> Where'd you come from? I fell asleep in class. So? My teacher said I need to get some coffee to wake me up more. Which teacher did you come from? Mr. Soggy. Soggy is completely against coffee. I remember when he told a story about coffee. He spilled 10 full mugs of coffee in his clothes in his first grade and everyone teased him. They called him Coffee Sog or something like that and he hated that. He didn't like the way coffee tasted that much either. Considering that would that he would certainly told you to come and get coffee to wake you up. Shoo! Wow. Where'd you come from? I fell asleep in class, so my teacher said I could get some coffee. Wake up. Which teacher did you come from? Mrs. Count. Mrs. Count I'm Miss Count and you know that. Shoo! Where'd you come from? Fell asleep in class, so, uh, my teacher, uh, Mrs. Odverb. Mrs. Odverb, you say? Why, that's my name, too. you probably get back to class. Where'd you come from? I fell asleep in class, so, wake up coffee, Mr. Oboe. Who's Mr. Oboe? Isn't he the band teacher at the middle school? Oh, yeah, that's right. Shoo. Where'd you come, where'd you come from? I fell asleep in class, so coffee to wake up. Mr. Clowny Big Shoe. That's a laugh. Shoe. Where'd you come from? I fell asleep in class, so my teacher said wake up coffee. So you're a bear. No, you're a bear. Get go back to class. <laughs> Where'd you come from? I want a chlorophyll too. I don't have an extra two hundred dollars on me right now. I think I do. What do you want your chlorophyll in? Just a soda can would be fine. Alright, I have $19, three quarters, two dimes, and four pennies. That should be enough. Actually, that adds up to $197.99. You're $2 and a penny short. I know I should have brought, shouldn't have bought those cheesy skull pencils. Oh well, you should, probably shouldn't be in here anyway. Where'd you come from? Oh wait, I fell asleep. I think it's because school is fun as watching grass grow. I love watching grass grow. Do you want to see the 8 hour grass growing video that I taped last Saturday? Yes, I would love to spend 8 hours of my time watching that. Oh wait, my friend at the fast food place has it right now. Looks like it's not going to happen. Bye. Wow, there's a lot of choices. No, it sounds like a cure for insomnia. No, it's exciting! Go away! Where'd you come from? Chlorophyll. Uh, in a coffee mug. Sorry, those coffee mugs are for coffee only. I like it in my mouth. The vending machine doesn't have that option. In a glass. As cold that would be, this vending machine does not have a glass maker. I like it in an old shoe. <laughs> I don't think I don't want anyone taking off their shoes in here. Uh, also, vanilla cups, Emery. Vanilla doesn't cup. You are wrong. Shoe. <laughs> My goodness. Where'd you come from? I got a 20 ton cat in the hallway. A 20 ton cat in the hallway? It's the size of my thumb. There's no way a 20 ton cat is the size of your thumb. Uh, my thumb, maybe, but your thumb, no. Shoo. 20 ton cat. 20 ton cat in the hallway. Yeah, you can hear it meowing right now. I don't hear anything. Me neither. Are you blind? Can't you hear it? Stop messing with my mind! <laughs> Where'd you come from? Uh, 20 ton cat. 20 ton cat in the hallway. Actually, I think it's a dinosaur, not a cat. Don't- Didn't dinosaurs go extinct millions of years ago? The di- The chance of dinosaurs in the hallway as this soda is being elected president. 
It's not much, by the way. Instead of making a crazy dinosaur stories, go away. Alright. Where'd you come from? I want Clor- Oh, no, 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 no. Where'd you come from? 22 ton cat in the hallway. I weighed it. So you expect us to believe that 40,000 pound cat is in the school? It sounds like a bit like my cat. What does it look like? It was orange with black stripes. I hate Mondays. <laughs> Let's keep going. <laughs> I weighed it. Shade of brown. It's the color of my cat. How big is it? Not as bad as your face. My face isn't that bad, is it? Besides the blue whale, that must be an exaggeration. It wouldn't fit in the school if the cat was that big. Besides the grand piano, that's just grand. How many four? How many four? Forty thousand grand pianos do you know of? It's exactly the size and shape of a sock. Either those are some huge socks, or that's just one weird shaped kitten. Either way, there's obviously no twenty-ton cat in the hallway. Where'd you come from, twenty-ton cat? I weighed it. It's big black witch cat. Ha, huh, yeah, it came to full skull flying on broom, size of full grown redwood tree. Go back to class. Uh, Alright, anyway. Uh, 20 ton cat. I weighed it. It's now pink, purple, green, and blue polka dots. Sounds like a cat on Mars. Go away. Where'd you come from? <laughs> what? It's not for about Richie. What about Richie? Bread comes with briefer spit. What's that have anything to do? What about Richie? He doesn't know what a Goomba Troopa is. Neither do I, actually. Is it something else I should know? I beat the stuffing out of it. Yes! I mean, go back to class. <laughs> Where'd you come from? About Richie. He's stuck in his locker. His combination's in your class. Again, do I have to go back? Do you think I should go back to my class and look for the combination now? You smell like an elephant. Answer the question. No. Huh? Yes. I should probably leave too. I spent so much time in that stupid room. <laughs> I'm looking at my recording. I spent 18 minutes so far. So let's check these drawers. No. No. Aha! Blah blah. I could have sworn the apple in the picture didn't have a bite in it a minute ago. The room's bright enough and we're ready. I don't think you need to turn on the lamp. Core fell for $200. I, I need more money. Alright. Now let's save Richie. That's Mrs. Oddverb, isn't that odd? Spelling test. As much. I studied as much as I could for that test. I'm already angry. The letter green isn't as awesome as the color six. To be or not to be. That is the poster. The stars in this poster smell moo. Must be part of the Milky Way. I found a combination to Ricky's locker. Was what the goat? Does it say blobbles? Somebody get out, get me out of this locker. Alright. Maybe it's, ah, it's upside down. So, five. Three. Seven. Eight. Eight. 
zero, seven, eight. Got it. Fill egg tree. Ah, the combination. Thanks. By the way, I'm collecting buttons. Is that, is your button making machine almost complete, Mrs. Flax? Well, I feel silly to admit it, but I can't turn it on. It needs a switch or a button to even work. So I need a button to make a button. It doesn't have to be big. All I need is something larger than a pistachio nut. The message is false. H2O equals breadsticks. H2O equals water. Breadsticks equal tasty. I have no clue what that's supposed to be a picture of. I don't. I think Pluto's no longer a planet because Chubb ate it. There's a flask picture on the wall. This flask actually looks like a flask. She does. Let's see here. Oh my gosh. Monkey around, okay. Go bananas for algebra. I can't call that my favorite poster ever. There's even a monkey on the back blackboard. I hate monkeys! <laughs> Stuffed monkey doll, they're one of a kind. Wait a minute, something in there. Ah, a button. It's start. Oh, penny, 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 penny. Any more pennies? I don't see any right now. Heh, <laughs> nice. Here's my last quarter, keep it. I'm looking for any more pennies. Is there anything else in Mrs. Counselor? Cold Trash Bro, I want one of those. Uh, no. I don't think Mr. Soggy has anything. Soccer. Ah, uh, there's nothing in the t-shirt rooms. What's in the auditorium? The auditorium's only unlocked during school performances. That won't happen anytime soon, though. Alright, so... Oh, right. So, let's go to the bathroom real quick. He says he can detect a leak, so let's put it... Aha! Do I hear a toilet clog? Wait, Jander's closet is downstairs, isn't it? No, it's upstairs. There it is, alright. Quarter, I just need one more cent. So there's gotta be a penny somewhere. Ah, I saw it, I saw it, I saw it. There you are. Got a dollar. Sweet.
I like chocolate pudding. Whoa, that's a lot of chocolate pudding. <laughs> da 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 Oh my gosh Who knew Chubb would make a great wrecking ball? Hello, this is Mrs. Moose's hug. Oh Give me all your money. You're insolent, tough and large. Speak for yourself, kid. Five appears to be asleep, so what do you want me to do? Pet him. I see you're not needed here. Have a nice day. Uh, Wake him up. Huh? Like that would do anything. I'm not going to wake him up just because you said so, especially when there's no point in doing it. I see you're not needed here. Have a nice day. Count. One, two, three, four, five. That was exciting. Can you leave now? What do you want me to do? Bash my shoes against the ceiling for 20 minutes. <laughs> I can see you're not needed here. Have a nice day. How can I help you? A lot of wards behind you. Yes, we got the clean office award, the worst office award, the fattest office award, the dull office award, the ugliest office award, the hall award, the hunt office award, the dirtiest office award, and the Nario office award, all on the same day. Wow. Well, I my picture on the wall. I can't find a picture of the counselor. I'm here to see Mr. Potato. Why would you be sending the counselor? I have a ruler with gum on it. I can see you're not any deer having a nice day. You know why? Because I am awesome. I failed to see the logic of that. Dang it. Go right on, done. I swear, the counselors are getting dumber and dumber. Upstairs. That is an ugly Volkswagen. Well, that was certainly interesting. So, if you liked this video, make sure you press the uh, flying pig. Oh, I get it, because he said he would say he would escape when pigs fly. Okay, so anyway, if you liked this video, make sure you press that like button and subscribe. And tell your friends, this is One Super Gamer. What just happened? Uh, signing out.